What's up, ladies and gentlemen? This is Afro Joe coming with you with this shit right here. I gotta tell you. I set up on my uh, video, and there was rumors going around about this brother named Ninja. I know the brother does not like me whatsoever, and I don't give a damn about it. <laughs> I think it was like Ninja One Nine One Six Nine or something like it. And the story goes, man. I read a blog. And the blog, I thought, I was like, oh my god, I can't believe this has happened. I said, that's so disrespectful for this, for this guy, man, to do. What happened was, Ninja went around on my video and talking to people. And talking to married women, or women who has fiance, uh, fiancés and boyfriends and all like that. And he's been going around showing... Uh, Giving them uh, pictures of his dick, his dick and balls, while he's sitting on his on his couch with his showing his face. I'm sitting up there, I'm sitting there laughing. I said, "Dude, the best thing for you is not to show your face." When he showed his face, I found out that his daughter's name is. I found out his daughter I know is Devil Princess. And the first thing I thought was, I said, "Oh my God, what did this guy do?" So you got a daughter that comes on the site that you come on, but you show your dick to everybody, every woman on this site. Now I always told people, watch what you do and say on this site. Oh no, Afro Joe is crazy. But it's like this, y'all. He said they and gave uh, pictures of it here. Cause one thing was, now there's certain people I know that was gonna get back to him. Uh, get back to him. one of them was Stephen Bravo because I know uh, if he sent them pictures out it was going to get back to Stephen Bravo or uh, Jerk Off Ray or FB3 or Killer Blends or Famous now you know we some bad people when it comes down to it and I knew they was going to come back to one of us especially Stephen Bravo <laughs> and I'm sitting there just like okay man dude Ninja you stupid as hell your daughter sits on that couch where you beat your meat on where you nothing on that couch and you come onto the site that your daughter comes on to oh my god it was like you know how embarrassing that shit is now think about it I don't know if this girl's in school or not or else she probably graduated now think about it she must be embarrassed as hell to find out that her dad was sitting on the couch jerking his me on that couch butt naked and sh shipping pictures to Married, engaged women who has husbands and fiancés and boyfriends. I was like, okay, this guy's on crack or something. But you know what, though? Once it's out there, it's out there. Ninja, you screwed yourself out of some shit. And you can get mad at me all you want, but this is your fault. You're the one to put the bullet in the, in the gun and pull the trigger yourself. You're as much as guilty as the next person. See, ladies and gentlemen, I'll tell y'all. I tell y'all, this dude is stupid. This dude is stupid as bucker. He's big. He's stupid as hell. <laughs> Never ship your penis. Never ship a woman on LV. Cause one thing is, if if you send a woman on LV a picture of your car, you better hope and pray that she doesn't know me. Jerk off Rail, FB3, Killer Blends, Famous One, or Stephen Bravo, or Bri Fry. Cause I can tell you this, we gonna embarrass the shit out of you, man. No matter which way you look at it, either on live video or either on here. You know this video is going up on YouTube and MySpace. And Ninja, you are screwed, son. Your daughter's probably gonna see this video too. If she does, you need to explain yourself to your child the reason why you showed your dick to every woman on the site. Doesn't matter if it was on live video or Skype. You are wrong, sir. You was out of place. All these dudes that was dating, all these men that you sent, all these women, all them pictures that you sent to them women, their man ought to kick your ass for what you did. I wouldn't blame every man, especially a uh, big deal, ready deal, uh, big deal. I wouldn't, hey, look, I'll back big deal up with your ass. I'm sorry if I mess up your name, but I don't care. I'll back him up with your ass myself because that was so disrespectful.
But it is what it is, man. Go. That's how it is, man. You fucked yourself over. And you fucked your child over. When you fucked your child over, you are a dumb, pathetic piece of shit. And you are to blame for what happens. Don't run to fucking principal or EA uh, J man or a uh, voice to pull you out of this shit. You can't get out of this. You made yourself look stupid. Ain't no way in hell they can fix this issue. Like I said, man, this bullshit. Y'all holler at me.